everyone and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new here today we are going shopping again I'm gonna try and go to Zara to H&M and to Marks and Spencers I know you guys want to see more of mango unfortunately there is no mango in Manchester anymore they have closed it so that is the only reason I haven't done more of mango. I love mango, it's like one of my favorite shops, especially with the collections that they have going on at the moment. However, next week we are going to London and I will do mango and Cezanne, so stay tuned for that. I am wrapped and ready. I try to wear something easy when I go shopping because I changed so, I changed so many times. And I'm wearing this big, like, Cozy jump from H&M, my Joseph leggings, my old other stories boots that I absolutely love, kind of matching there. So yeah, super excited to go shopping again. So yeah, let's go. You guys, we're in Marks and Spencers, Whee! and they actually have so many good things. Um, grabbed quite a lot of stuff, still need to go back for more. First we have this beautiful autumnal dress, I really love the colours. Um, they're like green, burgundy, beige, and then there is like a ribbon at the waist. And I love the piping as well here. These boots are really really nice, I love like the shape of the front. Really nice heel as well, very very comfortable. Oh, I forgot the dirty tie. I think this colour will just complement so many skin tones. Really, really nice. And look at this beautiful coat, um, like a Czech heavy coat. And this super adorable, cute patent leather bag. £25, not bad, and there's a long strap. Really lovely such a cute little bag for autumn and winter but this coat is such a nice quality it has like really nice weight to it but i think that even together this looks nice but to be honest this coat will look nice than anything it's just a classic piece really really like these boots love the colors all together i had to swap from my camera to my phone because my camera just gave up on me i have no idea what happened which is stressing me out a little bit but hey Never mind, we will survive. So yeah, really, really like this cute little look. Um, let's move on. Another super cute little dress, like a spotty one. I absolutely love it. It's very Chloe-like. Love the length as well as just above the knee. Um, for those who usually ask, I'm five foot nine and a half, so 177 centimeters. Still have the same boots on. So cute little bag. Absolutely love this dress. Another outfit. Look at this skirt, you guys. A leather skirt. Like this really nice thick leather. Painted, super, super nice. Like a beautiful petrol green. Then I have this uh, top that is actually quite cute. I will show you the back of it as well. And I love all the colors together. And also another pair of cute boots. This are like sock boots. This are like purplish and they also do them in black of course if you want you can either put a turtleneck or a chunky knit or maybe a really nice scarf this skirt is <laughs> too big for me so i'm holding it with a hanger but i wanted to show you the back it's like a low back and then it has like little ties there which is really really nice or of course we can put a jumper with it this is cashmere and max expenses cashmere is like my favorite cashmere i buy it every single year and i really like this one actually i love the love the shape here of course you can also tuck it in and that will look nice and it will look even better with the coat so i really like the colors together I'm clearly feeling the pleated skirts, especially this one. They unfortunately don't have my size, otherwise I would absolutely be taking the skirt with me. But look how amazing this looks. Love this pleat here, kind of like a gathered pleat. Beautiful, and I just have it with the same cashmere, with the same little bag, and the brown leather boots. I love those boots guys, those boots will look amazing with jeans as well. That skirt is just, yes, 
Yes, yes, yes, yes. Lovely little skirt, you guys. It's like suede and then leather and then suede again. Obviously, they're not suede or leather, but you know, looks pretty good still. Buttons all the way down. This one is burgundy, I think. They also do a petrol one, maybe. And I really, really like it with the thick tights. Maybe a long boot would look really cool. Another cool dress, you guys, like a leopard print, but this one is like in a beautiful pink. And there's also a tie at the waist, but I actually like it without the tie. This is size 18, which normally I am 8 to 10, so quite a big one, but I actually like it oversized. Uh, pleated skirt, buttons going all the way up. Really, really like it. The dress will look really nice with a jumper over it as well. Maybe not a, such a thin one, so maybe not as see-through because you can literally see that my skin is leopard. But I think that it will look really nice with a jumper as well. You guys, really lovely lavender knit. Useful, beautiful, chunky, soft knit. Really like the color of this, and you can kind of like clutch it over the shoulder if you're feeling a bit sexy and I love the pleating on the sides as well and also these jeans really love this two-tone jeans a lot of people ask me where I got mine and I have two pairs I have one from other stores and one from Levi's this is a really really good pair love that they're distressed at the hem same sock boots really like this cute little outfit and one more look actually no there is one more a uh, beautiful corduroy navy blazer really really lovely quality really soft this is a size 8 but i would probably go 10 um just because it's a little bit tight in the shoulders and to be honest i like things oversized anyways um same turtleneck and beneath a pair of jeans and I think that brown just goes together with navy so well but to be honest the burgundy boots would look really cute too I'm loving this bag you guys such a handy little bag like I just love it it's just so easy to wear it blazer would look really nice over a dress uh, with a skirt as well Another really lovely dress for autumn. It's like this silver grey snakeskin. Really, really lovely. Nice fit. This is a size 16, so a bit big for me. Um, really cute bell sleeves and nice length. Really like the neckline. It's like a tie here, but it's very, very stretchy, like it with an elastic. And same with the waist, it's on an elastic. I love the combination of grey and lavender or purple and I actually think that, that looks really nice and I don't mind the fact that the dress is peeking out, I think that actually adds the detail and then you have the length of the skirt. We're in H&M and 70s are totally back and the music here is like This is their Morris & Co collaboration, there are a few dresses, a few shirts, some nice pants. To be honest, I just grabbed a shirt because it was a bit, it was all a bit same. Everything was the same, like same pattern, same color scheme. This shirt is cute, it's quite a long one. So this is how it is, it's like more of a tunic, but because these jeans are cropped, I prefer tucking it in, otherwise it like, cuts me in too many pieces. But these jeans, however, I love. They're like a clop, cropped flare. You have to be careful with these because they can make you look quite short. But um, I like it with the boot like that, with a the heel, they always look great. The boots are actually quite cute. <laughs> you guys must think I'm like such a fool. I always dance when I do my shopping videos. I found the brown version of my big coat. I feel like a pimp, but <laughs> I'm okay with that. Love this coat so much. I would absolutely have it in both colors, honestly, but 
they take up so much space I can only store one but this color is gorgeous soft as well for reference this is size 10 and yeah it's the same price $79.99 really like this grey chunky jumper you guys, really really nice, like a wide sleeve, quite wide here as well but I quite like that and I love 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 that kind of knit and it's not like itchy, it's actually quite soft, I think that that's quite nice for winter. I don't know about you but I love a boiler suit and this one I like a lot and it looks like kind of fabric that won't crease which is great really nice like tailored look wide trouser I am five foot nine and a half again so I'm quite tall bear that in mind I absolutely love this one such an easy piece to wear in autumn and winter because you can always just throw a turtleneck underneath, layer up, throw a coat over, you're ready to go. Or you can put a jumper over it. I really like this wool blend navy one. A few more things I want to show you. This really nice puffer jacket. It's very Balenciaga. For a fraction of the price zips up all the way down or you can have like the collar out really big really nice really warm this is how it is when it's buttoned up has a nice hood as well i love it you guys i really like it and yeah i still got the boiler shit on which i actually really like like all together and these boots you guys, I really, really like, this is like a al good alternative to oaks and things like that. This keep the shape better, the sole is better, yeah. they actually like fur lined inside. I'm feeling nice and warm, a little too warm. The puffer jacket is $39.99, the boiler suit is $59.99. You guys, we're in Zara and I have my first outfit for you. First of all, this suede like leggings, which they do every single year, that are amazing. I think that they are such a good buy. They do them in different colors, they're super soft, super stretchy, really comfy. And then this really lovely shirt, very Versace like. They do a lot of that print at the moment. And also, these boots love these boots they're like really wide at the ankle with some tassels at the back bit of cowboy situation really nice and you guys absolutely love this cardigan as an alternative to a light coat really really nice knitted sleeve it's knitted all the way but like chunky knitted sleeve knitted pockets i love a cardigan but this one is just so gorgeous. It would look beautiful with denim as well. What do we think? This cardigan as well. And I'm actually wearing it as a jumper. You can of course unbutton it, wear it over a t-shirt or whatever, turtleneck shirt. But I love it. It's like this beautiful chunky knit with really big buttons. Love it, love it, love it. A little bit cropped. and oversized, but I really like it. Still wearing those velvety pants that are so comfy. They're so, so, so comfortable. And they're 25 pounds. I'm wearing size medium and they're a perfect, perfect fit. So cute, it will look really nice over a dress as well. Really nice velvet skirt as well. Not velvet, corduroy, apologies. <laughs> Um, like a beautiful green it actually comes with a belt but the belt is so ugly I've actually hid it away and also this pair of sock boots that for some reason there was only one boot who stole the other boot <laughs> but yeah really really nice it actually fit really well around the ankle the heel is quite nice as well so really like the skirt just the color is so pretty Hard to show the color on the camera. It has like buttons going all the way down. 
And one more outfit in Zara with this absolute stunning knit. Like has like a plaid going around here. It's like more hairy, quite fluffy, um, but really, really warm. And it's quite long actually, but I really like it with this skirt. It's like a snake print, has buttons going all the way down. But it also actually comes with a belt, like a black leather belt, which is quite cute. I mean, I'm kind of on the fence with uh, belts that sometimes comes with skirts, but this one will do. And I've got my little sock boots again, which looks really nice together. Guys, I just got home from our shopping and yeah i'm so glad to be lying down Woo! it's always so like intense when i go shopping and film it i always get so many weird looks from shop assistants and you know the guys that work at the shop because i take like a lot of items and sometimes they only allow me six items so i keep going back and forward swapping items with them i was so frustrated um today with my camera so i apologize for the audio in marks and spencers not being very well because filming on the iphone is okay quality wise but the audio is just horrible so apologies for that all the links to all the items that i have tried on today will be in the description box below that of course depends on if it's available online sometimes the stock in the shop and online is different so if you can't find something online always pop into the store otherwise i hope you guys enjoyed this video i think my favorite today was actually marks and spencers i think a lot of people underestimate marks and spencers they have some really good stuff really good quality and the prices are not obnoxious so i really like it actually and yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know what were your favorite items what have you got your eye on hey shaggy <laughs> she just woke up hey kitten hey little cat so cute uh don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done that yet and hit that notification bell if you want to get notified about my videos. I post Tuesdays and Fridays and sometimes randomly I throw a video here and there if I feel like. But yeah, I love you all very much and I hope you're all having a wonderful day. And I will see you guys very, very soon in my next video. Bye!